for me, one of the things that I think will significantly impact most companies' ability to recruit successfully long term is whether or not they can retain their talent acquisition staff. So what do you do with that, right? These are people that are coming into the insurance industry that probably don't have any insurance experience. And they're coming into a, you know, drinking from the fire hose sort of workplace and all they're all they're given is a phone and a desk and a business card. Maybe some LinkedIn postings and a heck of a lot of job openings. To me, that is not successful. If it was, a lot of insurance agencies would still do that with their young producers, but they don't. So the first thing I think you need to do is you need to provide training and mentoring. And you need to do it both from the standpoint of how do we train our people into actually being recruiters, not just order takers, because there's a big difference then between building a career and washing out. I think the second thing you need to do is teach them about insurance engage them collaboratively with other parts of your company. How operations managers, department managers, salespeople in, engage and integrate with your talent acquisition staff makes a lot of difference of whether or not they like their job and can do it successfully for you. And I think the third thing is you need to move from a hiring strategy to a talent acquisition strategy. If all you're doing is asking them to take jobs, post jobs, screen applicants, and push them through the process, they're never gonna be really true recruiters. And so it really depends on how you wanna define your hiring process. If you just want them to move you through the process and get transactions done, then please don't muddy those waters by also wondering why you don't have real recruiting happening. But if you can move your talent acquisition staff from taking jobs, working through the process, to ultimately building a candidate database, building referral streams, and becoming project managers, where they have some authority to tell hiring managers, this is what I think we should do, this is what I don't think that you should do, now all of a sudden that becomes a really substantive kind of opportunity for them to stay long-term. And what would that long-term be? Most recruiters move jobs every 18 months, so if you can keep your talent acquisition staff in place for at least three to five years, you are killing it and you are substantially better than your competition.